you guys it's been such a long time since i was in front of a camera oh my god i, I don't even know how i'm feeling about this <laughs> it's been over one year um i'm not really nervous i'm just i think i'm, I'm blushing <laughs> okay for those who are seeing me for the first time my name is Bura Kinyanjui. I am a writer, I'm an actress, and, and I'm awesome. Yeah, and that's what this video is about. Just being awesome human beings. So, self-esteem. Self-esteem is your opinion about yourself your capability, your opinion about your capabilities and your limitations. So self-esteem can either be high or low. We are going for high self-esteem. But sometimes people struggle with low self-esteem and if you're feeling like you're not good enough or you're inadequate or, or you're just scared of letting people down, it could be that you're struggling with low self-esteem. So why is self-esteem important? Self-esteem is everything you guys. It has affects all aspects of your life. How you interact with people, how you carry yourself in the workplace, how you face challenges. It's, it's everything. And when you have low self-esteem, it gets very difficult to even build healthy relationships with people or just go about your normal day feeling good about yourself. There are those people who um, may have had high self-esteem and then maybe they went through a traumatic experience or maybe they lost their job, especially um, if you, you don't have a job and you know, Okay, here's the thing. There's something about money and high self-esteem. I don't know guys. It's just like when you have money, there's this, this, this confidence that, that you have. But when you don't have money, yeah, you have low self-esteem. You sometimes feel you have low self-esteem. Yeah. Okay. So we're going back to the basics on how to rebuild the self-esteem. These are simple things that I've thought about and I wanted to share with you guys. Um, yeah, okay. So first thing, take care of the inner voice. The inner voice is everything, I'm telling you. Do you know that voice that, that talks to you when you're alone? It's with you 24 seven and you can control it because that voice can come with negative Negative, 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 negativity, a lot of negativity. You, you hear things, you're like, I, I'm, I'm not good enough, I'm not adequate. And trust me, there's almost everyone has that moment where you feel you're not adequate, you're not good enough. Here's the thing, you need to be very intentional about taking care of that voice. When those thoughts come, when you're alone, you need to come to them. As soon as they come, just counter them. It's training yourself to think highly about yourself. It takes time, but it's a continuous process. And that's how you start rebuilding your self-esteem slowly by slowly. Take care of that voice. That voice is with you 24-7 all the time. 